Right, hello everyone. Welcome to Onboard uh, Refreshments. Today, I've got um, a Beaverton uh, beer to pass a bit of a review on. And to coincide with that, we're going to fly towards uh, London on this beautiful evening in, uh, in the south of England. Just get me bearings a bit. Yeah, we are. Looks like we're about on the course. Maybe a bit to the right. Yeah, so bear with us in, guys. We'll uh, have a bit of a fly around London, check out a few of the sites, and I will pass my thoughts on um, Beaver Town Heavy Gravity IPA. So then, Heavy Gravity uh, by Beavertown. It's an IPA. I bought it from my local Sainsbury's. I think it was on offer for just a couple of pounds. Normally about £3.50 the uh, retailer. I think I got it for £2. 6.5% ABV. It's uh, brewed in London, hence why we are making our way towards the capital at the minute. And first impressions of the can, it, it's crazy. The animations, the designs, the colours, they just stand out an absolute mile. On the shelf, as is the case with them, um, most Beaver Town lagers, they seem to have put a lot of um, thought and effort into the sort of branding and animation on the on the cans. It's full of um, spaceships and planets, and it just looks really good. So you'll be able to see from my um, my Instagram account again on board refreshments if you if you do follow that. I put a photo on there of the can next to the. Um, this beer that I've poured out and it looks almost like a glass of fresh orange juice it's really cloudy it looks really really fruity and from the smell it's very fruity very crisp very light um, on the website on Beaver Town's website and I'll put a link in in the description of how you can get straight to this heavy gra gravity IPA I'm drinking it's described as smooth and juicy and I 100% agree with that from the smell it smells fantastic and not even so much like an IPA, but very, very much like a fruit juice. And the proof is um, in the taste. From tasting this, it's, it's very, it's bursting with flavour to be honest. Particularly I can taste like mangoes and there's sort of hints of passion fruit. It's very sweet and sort of puts me in mind of something much, much sugary than, than an IPA, um, almost sherbet lemon lemony taste it seems to have with it um can't really taste much in terms of bitterness in terms of alcohol yeah no can't really taste that to be honest let's have a look where we're at at the minute fine towards it looks as if we're coming up to um london city airport yeah back to the beer definitely a lot of fruit there can't really taste much of the bitterness it um, seems to taste like a lot of other beaver town beaver town beers it's very similar in the way it tastes which you know it could be um, as a result of the way beaver town can produce all their beers you know it's got a taste of sort of neck oil or gamma ray which are two other two other beers that are produced by um, beaver town Overall, after a couple of mouthfuls, I think it's kind of underwhelming. And as I say, you can't really taste much of the bitterness. It's just there's an overriding taste of fruitiness and juiciness, which doesn't make me feel as if I'm drinking a beer, which isn't really what I want. You know, I want to be able to know I'm drinking a beer. It certainly doesn't taste 6.5% ABV, which is what it's marketed as. It certainly doesn't taste that. It's nice, it's fruity, but for me, I'd like to taste 
a little bit more in terms of ale, in terms of beer. And that's sort of letting this one down a little bit. So overall then folks, I think I'm going to give this one probably a 6 out of 10 um, as a sort of score. Um, to end the video I'm going to try my hardest not to um, crash into some skyscrapers. You can see just down below there's the city of London airport. Um, please enjoy the rest of the video. If you haven't already, like, subscribe, uh, press the bell and you'll get notifications when I am. Um, I produce new videos it would mean a lot as I try to um, grow the channel and if you could find me on Instagram as well I'm on there as well as onboard refreshments and um, if you could get on there give me a follow a like a su subscribe it would mean an awful lot to me please enjoy the rest of the video as I um, try not to crash flying around London and I'll see you again soon thanks guys